hello everyone welcome in this short video i am going to talk about azure backup center azure backup center provides a unified management experience of azure backups as you can see i have already logged into my azure portal to search the azure backup center we'll just search in global search bar and uh, we'll just type azure backup center and we can select from here it is still in preview it will take some time to release in GA here it is as we can see that uh, this is giving us a unified uh, backup details for example schedule backup on demand backups and how many restoration is going on right we can uh, filter down the uh, multiple data sources for example if you have multiple subscription we can just select them for example if i have selected the, my another subscription so now i can see that two uh, virtual machines are uh, backing up and uh, one backup is completed and another one is on demand is also completed there is no failure and uh, we can uh, further drill down uh, by choosing the data source type for example azure virtual machine backup uh, azure file uh, if we have any backup is going with azure file so we can uh, check those details as well in fact uh, we have now option to uh, filter down the uh, vaults as well so all the vaults or uh, for example if you wanted to uh, if you want to select some particular vault and see the backup status that is also possible and uh, apart from this uh, we can directly start the backup configuration from uh, from this backup center and uh, we'll just need to uh, define our data sources for example if i'm looking for a virtual machine i can just select data source like virtual machine then i will select the uh, appropriate vault where i want to you know uh, from which region or from on which uh, vault i wanted to store my uh, data so a uh, vault is basically a heart of uh, backup services so all the restore points all the data goes to the vault so this is how you know uh, we can start uh, we can set up the uh, backups from here we can simply add the virtual machines and here we can you know uh, define the uh, policies if you already have some policy you can select from the drop down and one another feature is now you know uh, it is providing like uh, we can only select the operating disk now okay for example if you have your machine have a, a multiple uh, data disk associated along with os disk so we can only take the backup of os disk we can skip the uh, taking backup of uh, data disk so that is also possible uh, now apart from this uh, we have backup policies backup instances if you have any and uh, we can uh, uh, select check all the vaults uh, if we have for example in my case i have two vaults are configured and one more enhancement is now the uh, azure backup policy are also incorporated with this portal so now we can directly configure the uh, policies so policy are basically provides the you know the compliance of our uh, data so if we are enabling the a policy we can simply enable and you know the assign the policy and uh, this policy says that for example if azure backup should be enabled for all the virtual machine right and uh, if you if you need to uh, basically you know it provides the governance uh, of uh, of uh, our data and virtual machines so this is how we can simply uh, configure the policies directly from here uh, before uh, uh, this backup center we used to go to azure policies and from there we have to search for this uh, such policies related to backup then we could enable for our workload so it's a short video about uh, the backup center i hope uh, you learned something from the uh, from this video i uh, hope you like it and i'll see you in next video till then see you bye bye